What's going on guys and welcome to Bow Gear RC videos. So today we are going to be starting a new uh, project. Not not so much starting it but finishing it. Um, we're going to start to finish it I should say. Uh, this if you don't know is Ugly Bubba. Now this uh, for you guys that are maybe newer to the channel and haven't seen this truck yet. Uh, what this is is this is the first uh, truck that I had on my channel um, this is the evolution of that truck it started out as an SCX 10-2 uh, ready to run uh, CRC 27 2017 JK and as you can see um, we did a little work to it since uh, back then <laughs> so uh, if you don't know let's let's just start out and uh, show you what we got going on here this chassis, of course, this is a uh, Pimpin' Crawlers chassis. Uh, this came along after I pretty much upgraded everything on the uh, SCX-10-2, and I was wondering what, what was next. And I discovered Pimpin' Crawlers, so I contacted Ryan over there, told him what I wanted, and uh, he, he knocked it out for me. So, uh, anyhow, from there, we took this... Uh, we took this chassis, we installed, uh, let's go ahead and turn this thing over here so we can see what we got going on. Um, we have pretty much, this is completely vanquished and incision. This is the Curry Rock Jocks. We have the eighth inch uh, stainless steel links. We have hardened steel incision drive shafts, hardened steel vanquished gears, uh, chromoly axle shafts, we have uh, 100 millimeter king shocks on this thing. We have, uh, we can't see up in here, but we do have uh, Robinson Racing gears in here with a uh, super shafty bomb proof transmission. We have the uh, Reefs 555 servo installed in this thing. Um, yeah, this truck is uh, pretty much pure testosterone. Now taking a look up front, we have the uh, the Warren winch. It has its own uh, little roll cage built in around it. Um, so we can see the light bar up here, again with its own roll cage. Inside, uh, when, when I first got this, uh, the interior that Ryan had put in it, his standard interior, was okay but I wanted something with a little bit more uh, scale detail so I got a uh, hold of Tim over at Tandem C Television and I had Tim to build a custom interior for this truck uh, this is a styrene custom made specifically for this and it was a pain to build because of the roll cage I had to build it through the roll cage so but yeah ugly bubba is sporting a custom interior um back here we have our receiver mount she's dovetailed in the back this thing has a ton of flex um but yeah what we lack with this truck is uh, basically at this point just the electronics so what my original intention was was to put the uh, axe system in this truck but i begin to wonder if uh, there's going to be enough room for the wiring underneath this interior for that particular uh, motor setup because of the three wires and the way they come out of the motor so i think what we're going to do is we're going to go with a standard 1080 and uh, of course we will uh, Put the spectrum in here because all of my trucks i'm going to put on one radio um we have a winch controller uh we have uh this is a common sense uh, light kit so we might be installing that um of course we got to have a bec in here so we can run this uh, reefs 555 servo and uh also, I have here some Boom Racing uh, overdrive gears for the front, and I'm still debating on whether I want to install those or not. We'll see how this thing runs when we get it, uh, you know, all the electronics installed in here. 
and uh, get it all working. We'll take it out for a test run. And uh, yeah, so that's what I got coming up, guys. We are going to get all this stuff installed in here and uh, see if we can get Ugly Bubba out on the trails. So if you're interested to know a little bit more about the history, if uh, it's the first time you've seen this truck or anything, um, I would suggest going back to my uh, 100 subscriber um, video because it kind of gives a, uh, oh, what do you call it, a montage of uh, this truck from the time it was an RTR up until the time that we got this particular chassis for it. So you get to see kind of how it developed and... Uh, you know kind of the history on this truck a little bit and uh but yeah we're gonna get this stuff installed in here uh see if we can get this thing out on the trails and do some videos so till next time guys oh uncle lee bogear rc videos saying i'll see ya